In just a few moments, people will crowd Norfolk City Council chambers to talk about Second Amendment rights. As we've seen in several local cities and counties, gun owners have been pressuring local authorities not to enforce any changes in federal gun laws. Tenor News Science Gina Revlo is live in Norfolk, where folks are starting to gather already. Gina? Yeah, guys, the city of Norfolk says they're expecting an overflow crowd of people yet again to show up at the meeting tonight in support of the Second Amendment. The Republican Party of Norfolk and the Virginia Citizens Defense League are out here. You can see some tables over my shoulder. They have voter registration tables set up, and they also have loudspeakers out here for people who can't get inside City Hall chambers tonight. Now, the issue of, of gun rights of Second Amendment uh, is not on the agenda tonight. However, this is at the forefront of many people's minds. With the Virginia Assembly now in session. It's also at the top of the list for lawmakers. Democrats have full control of the state capitol and have promised to bring in stricter gun laws. But gun rights advocates say the bills that are being proposed would make gun owners criminals. So they're coming here to city council to voice their concerns yet again. Is Norfolk going to pass a Second Amendment constitutional resolution? That's what we're asking for. We're not going away. We're going to be here. We're going to be fighting, setting up events like this, and this is not the only time we're going to be here. Now, the meeting starts tonight at 7 o'clock, and the city clerk's office is extending the cutoff time for people who want to sign up to speak to uh, city council this evening. So, again, that cutoff time is at 7:10, and we will have full coverage for you coming up later tonight on Wavy News at 10 and 11 about what happened inside. For now, reporting live in Norfolk, Gina Arevalo, 10 on your side.